Are you finished with your training? It's so that it's our duty to try. Good luck. This is a hospital compared to real battle. I'll give it all you got. I took it easy on you, you know, you should be grateful. Ah, you guys are stronger than I tell you be. We'll catch with you up later. Hey, Razor, are things going well? Damn it, I want to... I'm telling you, it's dangerous. So I must memorize and master. Okay. We have to water and that's... that's bad. The early life already left to go on duty. Did you guys train with your senior? The ship I supposed to boil left all right. If you guys haven't gone yet, maybe I'll join you. If only the warehouse was like this. Okay, let's go solving to the city. Okay, make sure you check bargain item. This is actually a rare item in useless accordion game. And it contain really good item, you know. Like extremely good item that you could only get later on on the game on a uh, regular shop, so. And it's half limited quantity. So buy it if you have the money. Like, yeah. Equip the rune on uh, we have. You could purchase fire orbs, but no, it's not really that important. We have lightning rune. Resident, about the armor, I'm really sorry that your formal light armor isn't ready yet. Everyone from apprentice to master is working hard at our atelier, but okay. So, your final 19, huh? Resident, good work getting this far. Iron's been scarce lately, Hand, it's high demand and price. Your new armor is probably still a long way off. Oh, that grandpa of mine, he consider you like his grandson, Rezro. You sure are a lucky guy, Rezro. Since being picked out of the ocean here, now you're a knight protecting Gaian. Don't never forget your gratitude to the Lord. Thank goodness I finally finished cleaning up after the festival. For next year's festival, I like to go for an even more flamboyant and impressive feel, yes. Cleaning finish, it was just unbelievable dirty after the festival, you know. Yeah. I know. Yo, Razdro, if you got some free time, why don't you play a little? Wait, what is this? Maybe I'll play. You want to start playing right away or do you want me to explain the game? What do you want to do? Can you explain it? Here, let me explain. First, you should know about life and dead tops. While the top is spinning on the table, it considered to be life. If it topples over or fall off the table, the top is considered to be dead. That's it. Pretty simple, right? Next, about the games. Each player gets three tops. The first to run out of life tops on the table losses. That's all there is to it. By the way, the brown tops on the left hand side are yours, Rezro. My tops are on the right hand side. Now, let's me elaborate on date. The game begins when both of us toss our first tops in at the same time by using the X button. Now, come the tricky part. Once you throw it your first top, you have to get ready to toss another one right away. That's because you never know where the top you just tossed might die. Oh yeah, even if you still have tops left, if all your tops on the table are dead, you lose, so be careful. But that's not to say that tossing in all three tops as fast as you can is necessarily a good idea. After all, you have a higher chance of surviving longer than your opponent if you toss them in later. Well, sometimes tops will collide or get flick out, but that's where tactics and luck come into play. I guess that's about it for the game. The only thing left to explain are the control. First, I'll tell you how to toss in the top. Pick a target location with the left analog sticks or the directional button. 
And get ready to press the X button to toss your top in. At this time, a gotch will appear on the left side with a moving arrow. Stop the arrow with the X button. The closer you stop the arrow to the red zone in the middle, the better your toss accuracy and top sand will be. Now, I'll show you how to wrap a string on the top. After you toss the first top, you'll have to wrap a string onto your top all by yourself. You can do this by rotating the left analog stick or pressing the directional button in a rotating motion. The tops on the table might die if you take your sweet time, so don't let your guard down. You can't toss the top by pressing the X button, even if you haven't entirely wrapped the string around it. But the less it's wrapped, the weaker it's been. I don't recommend it wrapping a top partially, expect in an emergency. By the way, if you toss in an unwrapped top, I'll topple over the instant it's tossed. That's it for the control. Well, you get used to it soon enough. Finally, the prizes. You get prizes based on how many matches you win in a row. Win once and you get medicines. 5 straight win and you get a cough drop. 10 straight win and you get an escape talisman. 15 straight win and you get a digital clock. And with 20 straight win, you'll get mixed herbs. Also, I've got special fries for the first time you reach each set of a number of wins, so try your best. However, if you lose even once in the middle of a winning streak, you'll get nothing. That concludes the explanation. Are you ready to give it a try now? Alright, let's do it. What? I don't understand. Oh, I should paint it myself. Hey, hey, I'll try again, okay. I don't understand, so let's just save save and play it. I mean, this is really stupid, I don't understand it. So you want to keep going? Yeah, whatever. Stupid, man. Alright, yeah. You want to start playing right away? It's it's really stupid mini games. It's not fun at all, it's confusing. And it's hard as hell. Not going to play it again. I mean... But it's time to recruit that guy. Because, yeah. The game is full of recruitment things. Hmm, what does a knight want? Half a long since retired. Whatever, man. Wherever. Hello, ma'am. Can I talk to you? Oh, knight, have you on the room? Are you sure? What? One eight hundred. Pretty expensive. Couldn't enter the room. Yeah, whatever. Let's go back. The off night. Okay, talk to this guy. Are oh, we going our patrol, Razro? Yes, let's go. Okay, let's go. You're going on patrol, aren't you? Go ahead and use the ship behind me. Now, choose from these two jobs. Defeat wall sea creature three times or deliver a document to middle port. Of course, delivering a document is more troublesome, but between you and me, you'll make more money that way. Well, you could also do both. No need to rush into the decision right away. Defeat wall sea creature three times. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, gone. Okay, kind of forgot how to control. You need just to go uh, three random battle. That is very easy. Yeah. Let's go.
you could use Anchor to explore the ship. Let's explore the ship first. If the pirates come, they'll teach the age of this word. Phew, I'm feeling a little woozy. It's true that you shouldn't be so close to the gun muzzle. I hope I'm not getting seasick. Okay, let's enter the... Cabin. There's a chest here. Come, talk to us if you run into any trouble. And it's in 5 5. The thing inside that box there is for emergency. Got it? Got it. Okay, let's depart. And after a three encounter, I fast forward to the time so it become easier to us. One more time. Ministry, <laughs> run battle. Let's go home, Razro. Let's say yes, and then we're going to uh, take the second mission that is departing the, the comment to middle port. Good work! I'm calling on you to carry out the next mission as well. Oh, yeah, there's another mission I'd like you to take on when you become stronger, so good luck for now. Uh, you could rest in your room if you want, but I'm pretty good right now. But I'm losing. Okay, let's just rest on our room first. Okay, we already rest up and let's go to the second mission. Hmm, looks like you began to get actually got a bit of Jedi camera. Would you like to give it a try? Our friends at Middleford have the details on it. Yes, then. I will head to Middleport. Okay, I'm counting on you. Do you know where the Middleport is? If you are ever on your press circle wire at out the sea to check for it. Okay. Let's turn off this. Change course, just press X there. Damn it, why the most move so fast? Yeah, it's moves like crazy, see? So freaking sensitive. Now they're going to move there. Oh, that's really bad. Uh, to accelerate, you could press up or R1. Okay, here we go. I want to accelerate, and that is middle port for you. Okay, the control is really bad. Damn it! Okay, I tried to control this, but it's really hard. And what with this? Ah, damn it! The random encounter. The random encounter is really bad. What the hell? 
Okay, I'll turn off the new. Uh, let's go to the middle port. Damn it! Okay, let's. Okay, there's old bell, not old bell. Okay, that is the island of Middleport. Damn it! Okay, I think I realize now why I hate this game. The random encounter is really crazy. It looks like we can make a landfall. Land. You're here, would you listen to this guy request? Uh, actually, I was fishing around here when I happened to run into a strange creature. It looks like a black furry thing shirt off. It's kind of cute looking, but it's terribly strong, or rather, it's really pesky. I have no clue at all that things look like a liking to me. Please get rid of it from me. I'm counting on you, myself is a guy, and there's a lot of people who swear by his selection that refuse to buy from anyone else. Thank you for your hard work. Are you ready to board the ship? No, not that. Please, defeat it. I will run you the best I can. Oh yes, it's defending stuff to breach. Your knight may want to strengthen your weapon as much as possible. Please, defeat it. I will run the best I can. Okay, okay. Thank you for coming all this way. To middle port. We have nice souvenir. We should spend, spend, spend. I hear there's an unbelievably huge monster that appears in the seas around here sometimes. Be careful. I'm telling you, I'm not making this up. Someone I knew said he saw it, and my gut instinct believe him. Middle port was occupied by Kuluk and was freed on the condition that we declare our independence from Giant. I bet you didn't know that. So I don't know what kind of talks went on among the higher ups for that to end up happening. Well, I'm sure it was because it would be beneficial to both sides. People come here from all sorts of places just to the business. It's fun just to watching them. Right now, it seems there aren't any particularly nice deal. Okay. Well, is there anything that strikes your fancy? Okay, that's right. If there's any preaching to be done with your man, let's see what you've got. Gravity, what a failure. Okay, we waste our money then, because they're still really bad. Can we sell it here? Of course not. Aroo! I'm from Nye, but the science sure has a liveliness to it. When it comes to shopping, it doesn't get any better than our island. Sure is. This town may be a little too noisy for this elderly man, I find it hard to relax. Considering the way of thrash, you must be Knight of Gaian. No wait, I know, you're a trainee, aren't you? That smith there seems to be pretty good, it looks the business I've been picking up lately. It must be thief that bring us together at this moment. Fancy a little game of size? Well, maybe I'll play a little. Which game will you play? Down to one, triple toss. I don't know what the game, so let's save state here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I must do something stupid like loading a uh, empty. 
Yes. Yeah. Down to one. You know the rules. I like you to teach me. Okay, let me explain. This is a game where we add texture and rolling the die. Whoever rolls at one first win, if anything else come up, you have to put in the same number of votes as you roll. Whoever wins get all the points in the pot. If it ends in a draw, it purchase split of the points in the pot. I do not play a game where you can't pay or share, so please don't play if you can afford it. Also, if the die leaps out of the ball, consider that and you lose. You'll have to take look carefully at the marks and roll so that it lands properly in the ball. Do you think you understand it now? I got it. Please decide how much points you wager. That's a safe state here. Let's try as much as we can. Oh, okay. Are you happy with the amount of pooch that you wear? I'll go with this. One. You lose. Damn it! Oh, that's really a bad game. Okay, you win. Do you want to continue? Okay. Okay. I'm um, rich. Like, okay. Let's check another triple toss. You know the rules. I like you to teach me. This is a game that we'll play by rolling dice during our turns. Of the three dice you roll, if two came up with the same number, the remaining die will be your score. After what, we'll compare our score. Whoever has the highest score wins. Simple, isn't it? But if you don't have a score after three tries, you will have no rule. Be careful. Oh yes, there are special situations, you get 4, 5, 6, or any triple, you win instantly. With 4, 5, 6, you get twice your wager. With a triple, you'll get triple. With 3 ones, quantiple. On the other hand, if you will instantly lose if you get 1, 2, 3, you have to pay twice your wager, so be careful. In addition, if any of the dice leap out of the ball, that's considered a dead roll and you lose. Look careful on the mark and roll so that it lands properly on the ball. Do you think you understand it now? I got it. Let's decide how much poetry you will want to wager. Okay. Okay, I use safe state here. Okay, I'll quit now. Please come again. Okay, we become rich suddenly. Of course, you could only do that if you're using safe state. If not, it's going to be hard to win it.